Are you looking for a solar generator to provide power on the go, keep your devices charged, and maybe even give you some home backup in the event of an outage? I've spent days studying the top generators on the market, and I found the best. I'm Ben Zentera, this is Solar Reviews Labs, and here is the top five solar generators for 2023. This is our pick for the best affordable battery on the market. It's the Opes 1200. It can hold 992 watt hours of electricity. It can put out 1200 watts at a time and surge up to 3600 watts. It's on sale direct from Opes right now for $549 which is a screaming deal. This is a medium-sized battery for the price of a small-sized battery. And here's why it's so good. Let's talk about the features. It's got three AC ports and a pure sine wave inverter on the front. It's got one DC cigarette lighter output and two 5521 barrel ports. It also has two USB-C power delivery ports up to 60 watts, but it can't charge from them. It does have two USB-A QC3 ports that can do 18 watts at a time. The reason that it's a bummer that the USB-C ports can't charge the thing is that it only has one charging port, this DC port on the front. And now the Opus 1200 comes with a 200 watt AC adapter that can charge it up pretty fast and can also charge from up to 240 watts of solar power. With 992 watt hours, this thing can charge your phone and other devices dozens of times and last for a couple days on the road without recharging. But of course, if you have that solar panel or a way to charge via AC, it can last you for as long as you need to go. Compared to the Jackery Explorer 1000, which is a very popular battery on the market, this thing has almost the exact same capacity, it can put out more wattage, and it costs about half as much. That's a screaming deal. And that's why the Opus 1200 is our pick for the best affordable battery. But it isn't the best portable battery. Let's cover that one next. It's the EcoFlow River 2 Pro. It's got 768 watt hours of storage, it can put out 800 watts continuous, and it can surge to up to 1600 watts. It costs $4.99 on the website right now, which is a great price. That's just 65 cents per watt hour. It's got all the inputs and outputs you need for a couple days in the wild, including four three-prong ACs, one cigarette lighter output, two 5521 barrel outputs, three USB-A and one USB-C that can do 100 watts output, but can also charge the unit. At 17.2 pounds, the River 2 Pro is super easy to carry. Even my 12-year-old kid can pick it up. And we took it on a camping trip. It lasted two nights, charging all the devices we needed to, to full while we slept. So as for portability, this thing has the second highest watt hours per pound of anything we tested. This has 45 watt hours per pound, which is really great. Uh, it makes it so you can carry it with you, but it provides more power than anything else out there. And if you do manage to get back to civilization, say a restaurant or one night in a hotel, you can charge this thing up with its 960 watt fast charging in an hour and a half. So that's the River 2 Pro. It takes whatever you can throw at it for short family outings, and that's why it's our best portable. So if you need a lot of power on the go, you need the best large portable. And that's this one right here, the Anchor Powerhouse 767. It has just over two kilowatt hours of storage and offers 2,400 watts of output. It costs just $1,599 as of this recording, and that's about 78 cents a watt hour. So that's a really good value. But this thing isn't uh, light on features either. So let's check those out. First, we've got this light and it has three levels of illumination. So you can see in the dark, you're out on location, you've got this available to you. Next, it's got a Bluetooth connection and it's controlled by an app. And the app experience is great. And it lets you control many settings that you can't do on the front here. There's also these five always on USB outputs, two USB A's and three USB C's with Anchor's IQ3 charging. And that provides up to hundred watts of power delivery. And of course, all these things can also be controlled within the app. And the AC section has these four three prong ports as well as one TT30 port. It's great if you have an RV and you can plug right into that. Another great feature of the Anchor Powerhouse 767 is this handle that pops out of the side. You can use it to lift the whole thing up and roll it wherever you want to go. And that portability is a really important feature. In fact, our video team took this out on location. They shot for hours, they plugged in all their cameras and all their lights, and they ran them all all day long with power to spare. But this isn't just good for on the go. Two kilowatt hours of storage is a lot and it can run parts of your home for a long time during a power outage. And you can add an Anchor 760 expansion battery for another two kilowatt hours for about $1,499. Now with those two batteries together, you could run an air conditioner for several hours, you could run a CPAP machine all night long, you could run your TV, your lights, your microwave, and whatever you need for an extended outage. And with solar recharging, you could have a solar panel out in the yard and charge this thing in the shade, and that means you can keep on going for several days if you need to. So the Anchor Powerhouse 767 is the one you want if you need a large amount of power on the go. If you're a mobile video crew, or if you have an RV that you take out in the wilderness for a long time, this is the one to get. And despite the fact that it's got a lot of good features, there's actually one battery that has even more features. So this is the EcoFlow Delta II Max. It's the most feature-rich battery we've tested. Like the Anchor, it's got just over two kilowatt hours of storage. It can do 2,400 watts continuous output and surge to 3,400 watts. That's a lot of watts. 
The cost on the EcoFlow website for this right now is $1,699. That's about 83 cents per watt hour, which is a little on the high side, but honestly, for how many features this thing packs in, it's a great price. The Delta 2 Max includes six three-prong AC outlets, one cigarette later DC out, two DC 5521 ports, four USB-A where two are fast charge and two are regular speed, and two USB-C 100 watt power delivery. Now, unlike its tiny companion, the River 2 Pro, this Delta 2 Max cannot charge from USB-C, but that's no matter because it charges from up to 3000 watts of AC power. The switch on the back can be set between 1800 watts or 3000 watts, so you can determine whether you wanna charge super fast or just very fast. 1800 watts is plenty of charging power and it will help you preserve your battery life. And a great app experience from EcoFlow brings all these features together. We just plugged this in in the studio and it was at 16%. Now it's currently set to charge at 1800 watts, which is a little over half of its max 3000 watt charging capacity. But in that half an hour time we had it plugged in, it went from 16% to 100%. That's fast. One of the best features about the EcoFlow Delta 2 Max is expandability. You can add up to two additional two kilowatt hour batteries, and each of them costs about $1,399. That's a total of 6.14 kilowatt hours about. And if you divide that by the cost, you end up with about 73 cents per watt hour. And while that doesn't bring this down into budget territory, it's a really great price. All these features are really cool and make the EcoFlow Delta 2 Max ultra usable. It can charge from a generator, it can charge from AC, and it can charge from solar. It can keep you off grid for long periods of time and it can expand up to six kilowatt hours to store all the energy you need for a prolonged outage or off grid situation. So the Delta 2 Max can truly do it all from running tools at an off grid job site to providing power for an outdoor event to giving you the peace of mind with home backup power when you need it. But there is one battery tester that does it just a little bit better. Now this combo right here is our best overall battery. It's the Bluetti AC300 and B300 battery. It's got just over three kilowatt hours of storage. It's expandable to 12 kilowatt hours. It's on sale right now for $2,999, which might seem like a lot of money, but it's absolutely worth it. Now the AC300 is the brains of the operation. It's got the inverter and most of the input output. Now the B300 is a three kilowatt hour battery, and you can stack up to four of these together for 12 kilowatt hours of storage. That's nearly as much as the Tesla Powerwall at 14 kilowatt hours. The reason the AC300 and B300 is our best overall battery is just how versatile it is. You can use this as a UPS backup in your home, which means it'll switch over within 20 milliseconds to keep critical devices powered in the event of a power outage. And that goes for medical devices, desktop computers, and all the above. Although we didn't mention this battery as our most feature-rich selection, it almost takes the prize there too. Its power output is second to none in this roundup. It can run a small AC or a mini split for many hours in an outage. The batteries can recharge with up to 3.6 kilowatts of solar, and that's about nine full-size rooftop panels. And the Bluetti app experience is really great too, providing you with tons of options for control. So all those features we just described are why we think the AC300 and B300 battery combo is the best solar battery on the market. So these are the top five solar generators for 2023. From the best portable to the most affordable, we covered them all. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.